everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to install blinds. This is a quick and easy way to give any room a fresh new look. Let's get started. 1. Introduction First, let's discuss the tools and materials you'll need. You'll need a drill, measuring tape, pencil, level, screwdriver, and of course, your new blinds. 2. Measuring your windows The first step is to measure your windows accurately. You want to measure the width and height of the window frame where you'll be installing the blinds. Make sure to measure in three places. The top, middle, and bottom for the width, and the left, middle, and right for the height. Write down the smallest width and height measurements to ensure the blinds will fit perfectly. 3. Marking the bracket locations. Next, we'll mark the locations for the mounting brackets. Hold one of the brackets up to the window frame where you want it to go and use a pencil to mark the screw holes. Do the same for the other side. Make sure the brackets are level with each other. You can use a level to double check. 4. Installing the brackets. Now it's time to install the brackets. Using your drill, make pilot holes where you marked the screw holes. This will make it easier to screw in the brackets. Once the pilot holes are ready, screw the brackets into place using your drill or screwdriver. 5. Hanging the blinds. With the brackets in place, it's time to hang the blinds. Most blinds will simply click into the brackets. Lift the blinds up and snap them into the brackets. Make sure the blinds are secure and test them to ensure they open and close smoothly. 6. Final adjustments. Finally, we'll make any necessary adjustments. If your blinds come with a valance, which is the decorative piece that goes over the top, attach it now. You may also need to adjust the length of the blinds. And there you have it, your new blinds are installed and looking great. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more DIY tips and tricks. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. See you next time.